Bonjour. Holy cow. This is a really interesting America moment. One of the questions I receive a fair amount is what have you been doing since quarantine? And the truth is a lot of it's super boring, especially in a video space. However, I also have been venturing out into the Pacific Northwest some in the way that is common to people who live here. So I thought for today's video I would show you three moments of Pacific Northwest life, quick relaxing adventures, because these are the kinds of adventures I've needed through quarantine. This kind of adventure is very correct to the way I go adventuring when I just have a little bit of time or when I can't go anywhere else or when I just want to go explore where I live a little bit more. I'm at Fort Casey, but we're going to the beach first, because like, beach first. Pacific Northwest vibes. <laughs> beach first. Michael said it looks like a snake that branch, woo! This warning sign, and we were joking about it, but that is not a step for safety. We're going around. What did you say you found? Tide pod. Don't eat it. But like, either way, don't eat it. Forbidden, forbidden Tide Pod? <laughs> All the Tide Pods are forbidden except for laundry. Ooh, the little rocks. The Osprey is the inspiration for the Seahawks football logo. Is that an Osprey? Oh, look at this, guys, we did it. Well, that was incredibly successful. The sign is right here. <laughs> <laughs> Holy cow, more. That's a, That's a bald, bald eagle, eagle, actually. That's the closest I've ever been to one. I've never seen a bald eagle in the wild before. He just went into this tree. This might be the bald eagle tree. And Michael's like, maybe we should get out of the car. And I was like, okay. Maybe like a bald eagle will come like right next to us. Did that make your weekend interesting? Yes. When I was a kid, I was told that would never happen. They were not just on the endangered species list. The bald eagle was kind of the poster child for endangered animals when I was growing up. It's the bald eagle nest viewing thing. This thing is broken. Oh, no, it's not. Michael, it works. No, it's just too big. Focus through a focal lens? Probably not. Can Michael use the thing? This is a really interesting America moment because there's the Sons of Norway Lodge. It's a ramen shop, and right here is that guy. Yep. How cute is this building? Oh, is it cuter because there's a window art? Yes. So that is three of the things that I really love to do to stay balanced and clear of mind. What is it that you do when you just need to get out of the house to have a little bit of an adventure? Maybe you travel somewhere close by or maybe you go to a specific place. Let me know in the comments below. Also, rock stars, I hope you have a great rest of the day.